up these gas to go. Again, coming from Los Angeles, ladies and gentlemen, make some noise for Marcela Samuel. How you guys doing? I'm your only black comic. You've seen a couple black guys walk around. They've been walking behind. There's not one behind me right now, is there? He's not behind me. Okay. Uh, <laughs> the first thing I want to say, you know, being a black comic in a comic convention, I want to say that Ewok lives matter. They do, okay? They have that one movie, but Ewok lives I'm just joking. Black lives matter. Except for my cousin Teddy, because he's a Star Wars track fan. <laughs> I'm sorry, I'm Star Wars for life. Like, I don't like that guy. I mean, um, <laughs> well, when it comes down to it, I'm a dirty black guy. I got a hot Asian wife, and it's annoying because when people find that out, they treat me like a level two Pokemon trainer with a really rare Pokemon. <laughs> they're like, where'd you find it? <laughs> like, can I get one? And then they're mad that I have it because they're like, he's out there killing. He's only level two. How did he get that? Oh my God. And then, you know, for me, it's the same thing because I'm just like, I don't know how I got this, but I'm winning. <laughs> like, I'm winning. I, I knocked her up. That's how I got it. I can't win. <laughs> like, that, that's what I did, buddy. That's what I did. Um, I'm nerdy, but I'm not nerdy by choice. I speak well, but I'm from the hood. Um, I, I'm, I'm nerdy because I, God kind of made, there's some things that's by choice and there's some things that's not. The things that are not by choice is God. God did this to me. He made me allergic to everything. All right, I'm lactose intolerant. Could you, I want to be a superhero one day. I can't be a superhero. Could you imagine if Captain America, America was lactose intolerant? He can't have cheese on his cheeseburger. There's nothing more American than a cheeseburger. Like, imagine, I'm allergic to cats. Could you imagine if Wolverine was allergic to cats? His arch nemesis is saber too. I'm the best at that. I'm the best at what I at. I'm just gonna pop these calls and stab me. Um, I mean, I, I want to be a superhero, but I'm allergic to cats. I can't do it. I'm allergic to penicillin. Penicillin saves people. <laughs> you know how difficult it is to be allergic to penicillin? That means before I pass out, when the ambulance is coming, I'm gonna be like, don't give me no penicillin. <laughs> It'll kill me. <laughs> Please don't. And it's funny, I did, that, I did that joke somewhere else that I want to be a superhero, but there's something stopping me. And I asked the crowd, I was like, what do you guys think is stopping me at another place? And they were like, you're black! <laughs> I was like, that's true. But I'm allergic to cats. It's because I'm allergic to cats. Um, I got kicked out of school when I was in high school, even though I'm a nerd. And it's because I was a nerd. And once again, this is what I'm saying. Some things I chose and some things happened to me. This is one of the things that I chose. I'm a comic book nerd. I love comic books. Like, I love them. DC, Marvel, I make it, okay? And I grew up in the hood, like I said. My grandmother, she, I was 16, and she bought me some painless shoes. And if y'all don't know about the hood, you can't have painless, especially if you're 16. You can't have painless shoes in the hood, all right? And I got in a fight with the kids, and then they said they suspended me. And my grandmother was like, I can't believe you. I give you everything you need and you want, and you still get suspended. You fight, you're fighting over shoes? What's wrong with you? I'm like, Granny, they light up when I walk. Where did you even find these in my size? For the love of God. And you know what she had the nerve to say? You know what her answer was? I thought you liked Spider Man. <laughs> I was like, I like Spider-Man, but they ain't cool. Like, no, like, where'd you find them in my side? <laughs> like, that's why I got kicked out. That's one of the nerd things that I chose, you know? Uh, when it comes down to it, my, I have a son. He's half Chinese, half black. And um, it's, it's hard being a nerd with my son being mixed because there's not so many mixed comic book characters out there. So one day I asked my son, I was like, I'm a Marvel guy, if you haven't figured. His name is Remington, all right? I named him, his name is Remington. So whenever anybody finds out that I got a son named Remington and I'm black, they're just like, you named him after a gun, right? No, I named him after Remy LeBeau, Gambit. <laughs> and then when I tell them that, they refuse to believe it. I'm like, no, he's named after, oh, there goes a black guy. <laughs> Told you one was gonna pop out behind me somewhere. Uh, <laughs> got him, all right, no, so, my son's name is Remy, all right? And he's a hybrid, and I'm, I'm a Marvel guy, I'm a Marvel guy. 
He loves Cyborg. Cyborg's DC. There's no issues in my house. I'm asking him, like, son, why do you like Cyborg so much? Why, man? This is a horrible house. Stand me up in here. Why do you like why do you like Cyborg so much? And he said the saddest, the funniest thing in the world, okay? He said, Well, Dad, you know I'm black and Chinese. Yeah, I knew black and Chinese. And he's like, Well, you know, Cyborg is half black and he's half computer. That's the closest thing I'm gonna get to a half black and half Asian superhero. <laughs> oh, y'all don't get it. He thought the Asian side of the computer was Asian. <laughs> he considered the cyborg part. A cyborg Asian. He's like, the closest thing I'm gonna get to a black and Asian guy. I had to be like, you know what? It's cool. Come on, let's go. Let's get some ice cream. Oh, wait, you're lactose intolerant like me. No, okay. Let's go get some soy ice cream. <laughs> right. um, it was funny when Danny was talking about DDR because look, Danny, I can do this. And if it said, I'm your butterfly, it would be right on rhythm. I promise. Now, I was that black guy that was at the, and it was just like, he don't know what he's doing. I was killing it. I was like, ah. I was all off the pad. <laughs> like, they were like, you gotta do that on the lights. And I was like, look the lights, man. I got this. Like, got this. Uh, we saw a lot of gamers that was here. Shout out to my homeboy John. He's a he's a Twitch gamer. I don't know if you guys know about this. It's basically like they stream playing video games online. JC, yeah, we got a gamer back there. We got a couple problems in the house. JC0083, that's the boy, that's the home. And it's sad though, because whenever I'm looking at his stream, People like him, and I'm out of breath. I was dancing too hard. <laughs> That's how you know I'm really a nerd. I'm skinny, but I'm like, out of shape. <laughs> Hold on. Hold on, I haven't lost my training at all. Give me Alright, I did the milk joke. Oh, I didn't do the soup. Wouldn't it be funny if Superman was allergic to gluten? <laughs> like, no, wouldn't that be like if the man of steel couldn't eat gluten? That would be hilarious. Alright, okay, I'm gonna stop. Got kicked out of school for the Spider Man shoes. Shout out my friend JC. He was cool. Hey, did y'all see the Ghostbuster walking around? Yeah. He was cool, huh? I was like, man, who are you gonna call? And he was like, Sullivan. I'm like, you're supposed to say Ghostbusters. <laughs> Is your name Sullivan? He's like, yeah. I'm like, no, see, I didn't get that because I didn't know that. You gotta warn me. We're gonna try it again. He's your neighbor? That dude is cool. He said he made that whole suit. You probably can tell me more about that, huh? <laughs> oh, all right, wait. So he's a ghostbuster. I'm right, a nerdy black guy with a hot wife. You like wives in there? Okay. Oh, he's doing pretty good here. Okay, so I got a Chinese dad at home, right? I call him my Chinese dad because it's my wife's father, which is cool, all right? And he bought me this watch. And I love this watch. But it's too big. It's way too big. Whenever any of my nerdy friends see it, they're like, man, that look like a mighty Morphin Power Ranger. Like, a Morphin. And then, you know, I, my friend made fun of me, and the next day I, I took a nap. And um, I had a dream. And I had a dream that I was a Power Ranger. And if this watch turned me into the Red Ranger. And I was just like, it was cool because I was like, it's Morphin time, Red Ranger. And it turned me into the Black Ranger. <laughs> And I was like, it's a dream. It's my dream, okay? It's my dream. And I'm like, no, I didn't want to be the Black Ranger. I wanted to be Tyrannosaurus. Morphin time, Red Ranger. And it turned me to the Black Ranger. I said, I don't want to be the Red Ranger. And it's like, you can be happy you're not a putty. <laughs> right? We could have turned you into a villain. I was like, I want to be the Black Ranger. Okay, that's my time. Have a good day. Thank you for having me. Right?